Exposure by Wilfred Owen. Our brains ache in the merciless east winds that nive us. Wearied, we keep awake because the night is silent. Low, drooping flares confuse our memories of the salient. Worried by silence, sentries whisper, curious, nervous, but nothing happens. Watching, we hear the mad gust tugging on the wire, like twitching agonies of men amongst its brambles. Northward, incessantly, the flickering gunnery rumbles, far off, like a dull rumour of some other war. What are we doing here? The poignant misery of dawn begins to grow. We only know war lasts, rain soaks, and clouds sag stormy. Dawn, massing in the east, her melancholy army attacks once more in ranks on shivering ranks of grey. But nothing happens. Sudden successive flights of bullets streak the silence, less deadly than the air that shudders black with snow, with sidelong flowing flakes that flock, pause and renew. We watch them wandering up and down the wind's nonchalance, but nothing happens. Pale flakes with fingering stealth come feeling for our faces. We cringe in holes, back on forgotten dreams and stare snow days deep into grassy ditches, so we drowse, sun-dozed, littered with blossoms, trickling where the blackbird fusses. Is it that we are dying? Slowly our ghosts drag home, glimpsing the sun fires glow through crusted dark red jewels. Crickets jingle there. For hours the innocent mice rejoice. The house is theirs. Shutters and doors all closed. On us the doors are closed. We turn back to our dying. Since we believe not otherwise can kind fires burn, nor ever sun smile, true on child, or field, or fruit. For God's invincible spring, our love is made afraid. Therefore, not loathed, we lie out here. Therefore we're born, for love of God seems dying. Tonight, his frost will fasten on this mud and us, shriveling many hands, puckering foreheads crisp. The burying party, picks and shovels in the shaking grasp, pours over half-known faces. All their eyes are ice, but nothing happens.